hello guys welcome to another new fresh tutorial of powerpoint in this video i'm going to show you how to create this cool infographic slide animation on just powerpoint without wasting any time let's get started at first you have to take a blank slide then take a rectangle shape and drag it over here then take a right triangle shape and drag it over here Go to arrange, select rotate and choose flip horizontally. After that press ctrl D to duplicate and place it over here. Again press ctrl D to duplicate. Make sure there are same distance between the triangles. After that select all the shapes. Go to format, select merge shapes and choose combine. Then go to the shape outline and make no outline. Then take a rectangle shape and drag it over here go to the shape outline make no outline and go to the shape field and change its color then right click on it and send it to back after that select the blue combined shape go to shape field and change its color as same as the slide background now take a rectangle shape drag it over here make no outline Press Ctrl E to duplicate and place it here. Again make a copy of this. Now change the color of this 3 triangle. After that select this 3 triangle. Right click on it. Send them to backward. And drag it here. Now you can add some text. According to your information. I am just adding some demo text for you. From my previous slide by copying them. It's time to animate them. Go to animation. Select this rectangle. Go to add animation. And select lines. Then place it according to your points by dragging the red dot. Also change its duration to 0.75 second and select after previous. Now select this text box. Go to add animation and select float in. Change its duration to 0.75 second and select with previous. Now select this text box. Go to add animation and select float in. Change its duration to 0.50 second and select after previous. Now select this text box. Go to add animation and select float in. Change its duration to 0 0.50 second and select after previous. Now just repeat the same process for other objects. I skip that part to save your time. Here our slide is ready. At last a little request to you. If you find this video useful then please share it with your friends so that they can also make their presentations better. Thanks for watching.